Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Banished. So let's continue our work here and let's hope that we uh, finish these tables quickly here. In fact, why don't we add a little bit of, of priority here. Because we really do need the additional fertilizer because I'm seeing more and more greenhouses without it. And that's going to really cut into our food production here. standard pasture here. Let's see. All these narrow boats. That's going to be a lot more people. 1230. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah, we still need lots of things here. Cherries, yeah. Cheese? Okay, what do you have for us? Goat cheese. Magical tools? Okay, that's gonna be too... Uh, <laughs> I'm curious to see how good they are. Magical tool. Alright, let's do it. 2000 charcoal, no problem. Okay, trade, dismiss. City blacksmith. Set you to carbon steel tools. Work you immediately. Yeah, right there. Good stuff. So we do have horses right here, and they produce some fertilizer. That's some freezing cows right here, 20. So let's also try to produce some specific buildings right here. Maybe we can fit them in here. This is a lot of housing already. So let's see. Pastures, that's probably going to be here, right? In the food processing. A dairy. Makes butter, cream, and cheese from milk. Dairy man. Okay. Milking farm. We do have some domesticated animals. Right? 25. And that means that we can build... Lots of things here. Old creamery. It's a working place which takes milk, so takes milk and makes cheese, buttercream, and yogurt. Red creamery. Crystal milk. Next is the base for the crystal barn. And an old dairy again. So, okay. Five extra, that should do. We have some domesticated animals here. So, let's find a small space to get a little bit more domesticated animals going here. Can we produce those here? Yeah, and it only requires two domesticated animals. Let's find a spot that's a little out of the way here. Somewhere with lots of homes nearby. Yeah, so that's gonna be here anyway. Let's do one here. Oh, that doesn't fit. That's too bad. I wanted to fit in two. You. Not just yet. Dig sand. Yes, please and thank you. Go 
Mm, let's see here. Domesticated animals. That's going to be right here. Because we're going to need a lot of them. Just for a little bit of additional milk production here. Could do two here. And keep this spot for all homes here. Yeah, let's do it. Right here, one right there. Just that we can safeguard our domesticated animals because those need lots of things. Mm. Well, let's actually have you work. One, two, three, four. We can add more. Yeah, like so. Okay, two stables going. Let's do it like this. And let's see here. Processed food. Dairies. Milking barn. Produces milk. But it's also quite a large building here. I can fit in a few here. Maybe here. Gonna be less in the way. Yeah, let's do this. Two milking barns, also, just to help with the uh, the milk production. I only have one pasture producing, so I want to get as much milk as I can here. And then let's build a dairy parlor. Put one right there. Thinking we're gonna need a bunch more. Dairy parlor. One, two, and three. Let's uh, try a few first. We can always add more. One, two, three. there. Out of all the other dairy parlors right there. So that should produce a couple of things that we can use right here. So Hartek, we're already doing that. Bread too. So let's do flour and cheese right here. Let's actually be a little bit smart about this so we can keep track. We have two blocks here. So let's do hard tech in the first one. Bread in the second one. Cheese bread. We should be able to produce that. Walnuts too. Apricots also. Flour and sugar. We can do that. Croissants with butter. We don't have vegetable oil yet. Okay. We also don't have salt. We do have herbs. We should have some chickens nearby. Or don't we? Let's have you produce the fodder. Right there. Yeah, no chickens, so that's gonna be no eggs, at least not nearby. More fodder, please, thank you. So let's add another pasture here. Copper ore. Okay, that is something. It's not at all what I expected. The stable's finished. Good stuff. Let's assign people there. Let's assign someone right away. The 
70 laborers, 30 builders. Yeah, this is going to be quite crowded here. We do have artisan homes here. Here also. Yeah, but some people are still living quite far away. Let's fix that. Artisan house. Oops. Let's try that again. Only producing food buildings and or food buildings or buildings that support the food so I'm thinking that's not going to be too bad here we can add a few homes every now and again that is not so good these dairy parlors need to finish up quickly a little bit of a gamble, but okay. I'm quickly running out of space here. Let's finishing. Let's finish off everything first. One hundred and twenty thousand food. Yeah, we can. Uh, we can survive a little hiccup here. Happiness is going down. Maybe we can purchase some happiness here. That is interesting. Crop field right here. More fodder. Raiders everywhere. So, this standard pasture here, it has trade deer in it, and it seems as though this copper ore might be an anomaly here, but it produces other trade deer. That means that it doesn't actually, this is not an edible, right? This is just more animals. Do they show up in my inventory? Trade deer, yes, okay, so we can. Aha! So we can use this trade deer to sell at one of our traders here. So why don't we. Yeah, we have plenty everywhere. Why don't we add, like, trade deer right here? Deer. Let's do 10 or so. I don't know. Just to see what they trade for. Because they are very expensive to purchase. They might be also very valuable to sell here. Okay, yeah, you're still maxed out. Let's go to 50,000. Let's just keep going. I have plenty of labor, so I don't need the additional... Uh, Additional workers. Stacks burner. Another stacks burner right there. Can we fit another milking barn in? Or, excuse me, dairy parlor? We can. Maybe even two. Maybe three? No, that's too, uh, that's too ambitious. This might already be too ambitious, but let's find out. 
Okay, do some more fertilizer. Haven't produced anything yet. More fodder, please and thank you. Yeah, so the more greenhouses we build, the more fertilizer and water we need. And the more fertilizer or more stables we build, we'll need even more water and also fodder. But I'm more worried about the water here. Let's go here. Let's make sure we don't run out. Oh, we have a milking barn there. We can still build more. Outbreak of influenza again. Yeah, let's get some more water. Do it. Water, no fodder. Do you have fodder? No. Do we still have fodder right here? 7,000 or so. Yeah, that's going to be plenty of fodder. It's just far away. That is not so good. We have a barn right there. So let's, uh, one, two, we have fodder right there, although that was a little late here. Dairy parlor. One, two, three. to 50,000, so that should be good also. Are you in a hospital yet? Yes, you are. Good stuff. Nearing 1250 here. We're still lagging in the housing, but let's contain that growth. Yeah, this happiness... That should be okay. So let's have you What about our oats? No oats? We should have plenty of wheat. We don't actually. So I'm gonna give a little bit of priority here. And only have domesticated animals when we need them. Should have them still. 21. We're gonna need 24. Okay, so let's produce a few more and use the wheat that we have. Like so. And hopefully more wheat will come in. Now that we have additional fertilizer here. Water tower should also start producing. Dairy parlor. Yes. More people. We 
here. Water was pretty good, right? Yeah, 3,000 or so. But we run out of water pretty quickly here. Let's see how much water you can collect. Stable? No, I don't need you. Dairy particle. Let's hold off. We have plenty of dairy uh, dairy particles here. Here we go. Let's see how much you can do in a season. We we'll probably need to wait for another season here. I'm not exactly sure when they started their work. Out of cherries? Okay. Just not. Let's add a few log cabins here. And let's add a few here also. Now it's going to be right here. season. That is... Oh, you're still picking up. Let's wait until this completes here. Yeah, fodder, water, everybody has stuff. That's good. Trade there. 250. That's not bad at all. It's not the uh, price that we have to pay for, but the trader has to make money also. So, yeah, this fodder here. One person to work there. Let's see how our, or rather, how much fodder our fodder farmer has. Produced in a season, so three people produce 800 or so. Okay, 800, 900, sure. Tea and squash? No, please and thank you. Happiness is still going down. Kitchen back up somewhat. Firewood, yeah, that should go pretty well. Tools also. Health still no. That is not so good. So this is a pretty central location. I might want to add two greenhouses here and two here. Just to get a little bit more herbs here, because we're burning through those quite quickly. Greenhouse. And we can always expand, of course. Right there. I'm thinking that... Let's see here. Yeah, you're still out. But we did add another class rare producer, so you should be producing more, taking up more herbs, and that's really, really hurting us here. 
but four greenhouses producing herbs that should be uh, more than plenty here 450 fodder goodness that is really good that is really really good so grass seeds are definitely the way to go here instead of this fodder farmer but it will require us to purchase some grass seeds here but I think they were quite cheap only 500 or so All of our greenhouses are working. You need flour and cheese. Yeah, I'm thinking we're gonna get... Yeah, that milk that's gonna... It's gonna require lots of milk here. Domesticated animals. Get some milking barn done. One, two, three, four. Need more milk. Just as a, just as a backfill here. Trade deer. How much did you produce? Six deer. And it's only producing enough of 16 here. So let's go to the max here. And let's go back to our trader here. And let's max this out with trade deer. This might actually be the best trade vehicle that I know because that is actually crazy one goes for 250 trade here is not used for anything else so we won't really be uh, be sidetracked there even if we run out of it we won't be into uh, we won't be in trouble that's good that's really good let's get another governor's office going still need to build a White House. <laughs> you know what? Let's do it. Why not? A central location, of course, but I've used up most of the space here. The fodder farmer is going to be less important now that we have the fields. So let's build the White House right there and that's gonna eat up all my stone here that's gonna be crazy city water tank more water please and thank you and a governor's office here small courthouse it's here right colonial hall Fantasy Castle, Lighthouse, Try Snowmats, okay so not there, all my buildings, no, schools, no, of course right here. Brings happiness. Barbershop. Dentist. Bathhouse. Well, we could do that. Globe Theater. That is a massive building. Wow. Could build one here. It's gonna be really out of the way though. Yeah, we should have left some space open just for this one. Oh, it fits here. <laughs> yeah, let's just do it. Why not? Needs lots of things. Iron fittings, which I don't have. Still that government building here. Let's do that before we forget. That's the whole reason. Let's build that one right there. So yeah, that's gonna be very, very heavy on the resources here. I'm liking those crop fields, that's excellent. 
something ran out here. Six. That might be a clay pit. No. Portable mine. Also no. Precious mines. Which one is it? Oh, that might be our tin mine, actually. That boy's, uh... There we go. Let's upgrade. Okay. Water tank. Great stuff. Let's also select the White House here. Where is it? White House. Well, we can keep it here. That's okay. Yeah, this is... this is okay. Well, let's have one more dairy parlor work here. And let's give a little bit of priority to this mine here. I do want to keep... at least... somewhat... steady supply of tin going, because without it, my meat tinneries here are going to be pretty useless. And those provide a lot of food. Let's see, how much did they produce? 1250. Yeah, that's a lot. That is a lot of food. Mm -hmm. Let's do it like this. are all ready to be built, so that shouldn't take too long here. Yeah, let's keep working on this uh, tin mine right there. Check out the traders real quick. What do you have? Yeah, I'm not looking to do anything right now. I don't even have crop field. At least not available. And iron fittings here. Do we have a foundry? Can we make iron fittings there? Where's this foundry? No, we cannot. So we're gonna have to check that out because iron fittings is not something that I think I can produce just yet. So we're gonna have to find a building where we can do that. But yeah, that's going to have to be for another episode, because it seems that we're out of time. So uh, I'd like to thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and hopefully see you in the next episode too. Thanks. <laughs>